Hey everybody, Brenton Randolph here, and I'm joined by South Lakes girls basketball coach Christy Winter Scott and guard Kendra Williams. So before we get started, uh, how are you guys doing today? We're doing great. Thank you for having us on. All right, and um, I'm doing I'm doing well. Awesome. And uh, Kendra, I hear that you're getting back from a, a behind the wheel session. So just um. Tell me a little bit about how Behind the Wheel's been going so far for you. Uh, Behind the Wheel is actually doing really well. My instructor's kind of crazy. I'm not going to lie. He's really <laughs> getting off the charts. Like, like, the people we drive with, honestly, they have no driving experience. So it's like, honestly, we almost got to a car and today and yesterday. So it's, it's pretty scary, but it's really interesting. But oh, boy. I'm on a big day. <laughs> well, that's scary to know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, it sounds like you you have quite an adventure going on there. And this season has been quite an adventure for South Lake so far. You guys are 11 and 8 and currently on a two-game winning streak. So, it seems like you guys are uh, getting into the groove here a little bit as the season gets later on. So, just um coach, tell me a little bit about um how you guys or what you guys have been doing well of late. I would say our defense has been um, something that we've been more most consistent with, especially in the last couple of games. Um, in our game against Yorktown, our last time out, we had 20 steals as a team, 13 deflections, and six blocks. So our activity on the defensive end has been really impressive. So uh, we're really proud about that because that's something that can be constant. You can make and, and miss shots day in and day out, but the defensive effort is something that has to be consistent. and sell up to our, our focus and energy and that's been really fantastic right and um you guys have been uh playing much better of late one of those wins uh the win before the one against yorktown came against mclean and that one went right down to the wire and kendra ended up hitting a game winning shot to uh finish off the highlanders so uh kendra just um tell me a little bit about what happened in that game winning play well, I mean, it honestly happens the same way every time. Taylor, one of our good, like one of our really good guards, fouls out, and then I go in. And I'm, I mean, my our point guards are really like they have really good basketball IQ, and I feel like it's every time I'm I'm open, they find me. It's honestly, it's really a team effort. Like it's a joint thing. I feel like it'll never happen if it's just one person. So as long as we're all like together on one page, I mean, stuff like that is just bound to happen. And when I mean. The adrenaline that rushes through my, like, I'm pretty sure our entire body is just <laughs> it's amazing. Like, it, it's definitely a team effort, though. I really do have to give one for my team because, I mean, there's a reason. If, if they don't find me, then it's like a basketball play. It could never, ever, it, it could never work. Right, and I mean, it's obviously a huge win for South Lakes and the Seahawks. It uh, stopped a uh, three-game slide that you guys had been on, so just, um, Tell me a little bit about how getting a, a thrilling victory like that can give you guys momentum um, as the season goes on. It definitely like pumps up our, you know, our adrenaline and gets us ready for the next game because we already know coming out once we're back on season, especially on South Lake, we know anything's possible. <clears throat> and so, I mean, just winning these games and getting down to the wire like this, we know we're, we're ready to eat. We know we're hungry. It's just a matter of putting it all together as a team. And I, as the season goes on, I really think we do put what we have, like our talents together, and we show up as a team. And when we do it, we're on top of it. Right. And um, this isn't your first game winner either. Uh, you had a game winner against Washington Lee <laughs> as well. And um, even though it seems like uh, South Lakes goes to uh, some other players, for, um, to lead the team in scoring, the ball seems to end up in your hands in the late game situation. So just um, how are you able to uh, come through in the clutch and uh, make those big shots when South Lakes really needs them? That's, like I said, it's just like our point guards, they find that, like they find me every time. And sometimes when I flip to the back, I'm always worried that maybe they won't, they won't see me, but our, they're spot on every time. They always give us that right amount of time, and then I'm right there at the basket, and that goes in. And every time, like, our our body language switches so quickly. Like, everyone's just in the air. It happens so quickly, too. It, it's, it's definitely, it's, it's like, it was.
was life changing. The first one was life changing for me because that had never happened to me before. Definitely enhanced my basketball, like how I felt as a player and how I feel like as a whole. Right, and I mean, obviously with those types of game-winning shots, definitely can be a life changer. You've been getting some um, recognition from uh, all Met Sports top plays and that sort of thing. So just how cool is it to see you, um, see yourself um, making these shots and like getting that kind of recognition? I mean, it's actually really cool. This is one of the, well, yeah, the first time other than the one that, the one of the McLean that day, I got an interview by the guy that, comes to our school, I believe his name is Ben. I think it's mm -hmm. Ben Simon. Yeah, Ben Simon. That was the first interview I've actually ever had. And then this one is the second. So it, it just makes it makes me feel I don't know, it makes me feel happy. And I just, I just honestly like I just like as a team it just makes us makes us I don't know, it just makes us have no words. <laughs> All right, and um well, we've got time for just one more question, so I'm gonna ask um, both of you guys, both of you. So, just what are some things that uh, the South Lakes has to do to um, make sure that the Seahawks finish this season off strong and uh, are um, looking pretty good going into uh, the playoffs? You want to do that first, Kendra, or you want me to? <laughs> uh, I can go first. Okay. Um, finish our season strong, we just need to stay strong-minded, and we need to finish the season out as a team, like, no matter what gets in our way, we need to remember, as always, like our coach said, we're, we're a Seahawk at blood, it's not about me, it's not about you, it's not about any individual person, as a team, every single one of us that on that court, we're a Seahawk, and we're, at the end of the day, we're going to be a Seahawk, so at the end of the day, if we remember who we truly are, and what we truly do this for, we can definitely stay founded in Keep a strong foundation as a team. And, you know, definitely co signing what Kendra just said, but I think for us to take strong momentum into the postseason, I think our defense is where we need to hang our hat. And we get a lot of offense from our defense, and we like to push the tempo. And I think when our energy is there, and it has been, I think when we play that way, we're at our best. And that's what we need. Going into the postseason, we need to be at our best in terms of our defensive attention details, and then our offense will come from that. So I'm confident with our team, and I'm confident with um, where our mindset is right now. And, you know, we have three more regular season games, and then it's to the playoffs, and then fresh record, and we're off and, and see what we can do. Well, all righty, Coach. Winner Scott and uh, Kendra, thank you very much for um, taking the time to join us here today. Um, be definitely appreciate it uh, and best of luck. No, thank you very much for your time and, and your support. And it means a lot. I mean, Kendra's only in the 10th grade, so guys the limit for her. And, and we're so excited for her progress and, and the fun that she's had this season with us. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, anytime. Definitely appreciate it. Thanks a lot.